wrestling days at Edinburgh. We start tonight at 125 pounds. Jared Trombley for NC State, the redshirt junior. Seven and six this year, Eddie Ventresca. He's just a freshman, a redshirt freshman. Out of Moxbury, New Jersey, he comes in 11 and five. So a lot of question marks coming in. Where will we start this duel? Well, the answer is 125. Old school tonight. Old school, I didn't anticipate it starting up at 25, but tradition isn't bad. Sean, my heart is racing, my feet are tapping. This is what wrestling fans want to see. NC State enters tonight unbeaten. Both of these teams had a really difficult non-conference portion of the schedule that we'll dive into a little bit later on. And we are underway. Trombley engaging first in the black for NC State. Ventresca, our first look at the redshirt freshman. Trombley's going to fire from a distance. And he feels that since coming down from 133, he said he feels pretty powerful at 125. Watch those hands, Jimmy. Trombley, a two-time NCAA qualifier, but keep in mind that was at 133 pounds back in 2020 and 21. Lost the wrestle-offs last year at 33 with Kai Arini, who we will see a little bit later on. And then what happens in this offseason, Jacob Camacho goes down with a torn ACL, so they ask Trombley to bump back down into the 125 role. off the arm, Ventresca trying to get to the corner a minute into this first period. Trombley is clubbing and looking for an underhook. He's clubbing with the left hand and trying to get an underhook with the right hand. And what Ventresca is doing, he's keeping his shoulder tight and trying to get an underhook go behind. Oh, these guys are moving quick. It could be adrenaline in the first match, but these guys are pretty quick anyway as 25 pounders. Trombley has been in this battle before with Virginia Tech. This is the uh, first time into the waters. Eddie Ventresca dipping his toe in the water for the first time with this heated rivalry. Red shirt season a year ago, wrestled in four tournaments, but he has emerged as the Hokie starter with Sam Latona bumping up to 33 pounds. And there were some questions earlier yeah, this week. If those hands, we were going to see Cooper Flynn or Eddie Ventresca, and it was a coach's decision that Eddie Ventresca is going to get the call. Inside a minute to go, first period. A little go behind, but look at the, no control yet. No control, no control, yet. no control, control no control, well. no control. Ventresca's holding no on to the toe. And what Trumbull's trying to do is trying to get his hips around, but Rantress is doing a good job of being patient and holding on to the no foot. Control. No control. They're looking for two, they want two yet, but control is felt, and I do believe that there is no control right now. Rantress is doing a good job of holding on to the foot. Trying to cover the hips, not quite yet. Now Rantress might want to try to hit in just a little bit. Stalemate, quick shot, quick defense. Ventress got a good job of holding onto the foot right there. Bang, right in. And looks like Ventress was going to get around, but went to a good situation where they both got in. Angel Rivera, our referee, along with Mike Burns tonight. Short time wrestling here in this first period. Trombley with the Offensive opportunity late, Ventresca able to dodge a bullet, and we're scoreless after the first period. It takes, I guess, a little bit to get these, those nerves out, a good floor like that, gets you free. And here the ACC wrestlers that are ranked, Eddie Ventresca, Jack Wagner, and Jared Trombley. I'm talking. Keep in mind, NC State is hoping to get Jacob Camacho back here in the next couple of weeks. And what a boost that would be, the two-time right, ACC hey, champion and three-time okay. NCAA right, that's qualifier. Trombley in the spotlight, though, tonight. On the whistle, gentlemen. Angel top. Rivera getting the two wrestlers into position, and the second period is underway. Ventresca tried a quick stand-up, gets up to his feet. Let's see if Trombley can deliver the mat return. Does not look like he will be able to, and a quick point. 
for Virginia Tech. That was kind of to be expected. He probably is uh, what's known as a good top wrestler. He's solid, but it wasn't anticipated he was going to ride him out for the period. The Tresca won a New Jersey State Championship that was at 120 pounds, wrestled for Pope John High School, talked about his red shirt last year, and this season at 9-5, and five, one of three ranked wrestlers in this conference, and, and I go back to the match with Malik Heinzelman of Ohio State. He wrestled well, lost by a point, 3-2 to two in the duel. Really some narrow losses, wrestled well in Las Vegas. Trump has got to close the gap. His last couple of shots that he had him in from a distance. And Eddie Ventress has just has good solid defense. He's not coming out of his stance. And so we got to watch Trombley shooting from a distance. He needs to get almost arms left away before he shoots. Hands to the face. Okay. Potentially Hands to dangerous the face. against Ventresca. Potentially Hands to the face. If it happens again, that'd be a point for Trombley. Potentially dangerous. It was a point Hands of up. emphasis a couple of years ago to try to knock that element out of the sport. Quick escape has been it for Ventresca. Will be Trombley's choice in the third. Both these guys are, are battle tested. When I mean they've had some tight matches, overtime matches. So while you want to win it in the regulation, these guys aren't afraid to go to an overtime match because they've been there before. Rock, like you were talking about earlier, you, you, you see where Trombley wants to go. He wants to get that left arm under hook. Try to drive that in and, and at least get Ventresca Hey, out of his comfort area, but he's been unable to do so. He's doing a good job of just banging the head. He's moving his hands, and he's clubbing hard. He's just got to watch him leading too much to open up an opportunity for Ventresca. Wolfpack fans hoping that the experience will pay off for Jared Trombley in the final two minutes. Ventresca is very good on top. Trombley has got to explode. Right, Green, you got one caution, okay? Get those hands up to face. It's time to be illegal. Set. Keep in mind. Up, red. Trombley with just the nine seconds of riding time. So he will try to return caution. the favor, but he was a you little bit whistle, quick. Okay? A caution given. One caution each. You get two freebies. Let's go, guys. On the whistle. Okay, here we your go. Opponent gets a point. Set. Sit-out position, Trombley. Start to work on the grip, and he is away. Really good job there. Patient, he isolated the right hand of Ventresca, and then the cut through. And that's what you learn in junior high. Very good job on a very game Ventresca is good top. So it becomes who can latch on the first takedown here. Neither wrestler able to do anything on top. Riding time not a factor, and down the home stretch we come, tied at one. A pivotal weight tonight when you look at it, so many weights you're just gonna toss up in the air. And there's a low strike, but Trombley able to hop skip his way out of trouble. One good thing that McCress is doing is keeping his stance. He's keeping his stance. And when keeping his stance, that creates an opportunity for a re-attack or a re-shot. You can sense that the, the fans on the edge of their seats, they, they want to start off hot. Everybody in this arena knows the significance here at 125. Again, it's been Tresca for the second time this period trying to drop to an ankle. Trombley's got a down block. He's trying to step through, and if he does not, if he doesn't step through, he can get in position of giving up a takedown. He's got a down block, meaning put his hand to the mat, match the level of Ventresca. He's just trying to kick away. Consecutive shots as Ventresca picks up the pace a little bit. Short time, he has to hold center. Stall call on Trombley. Into the attack for Ventresca. Trombley rolls through. Scramble situation. Down to two, down to one, and we go to sudden victory. Oh my. That was good. You know what was really good about that? Ventresca earned a stall call. So here's the last scramble here. Ventresca shot, got the stall card, and he was starting to turn 
and cut the corner. And what did Trauma do? He tried to dive through and kept the scramble going with short time. We were in overtime the first match. Momentum right now with Ventresca. Let's see if Trombley can get back on the offensive. A two-minute sudden victory. First one to score wins. If nothing is settled, we will go into two 30-second periods. Wrestle to the completion. And then a second sudden victory of a minute. Trombley looks like he's slowing down just a hair. And that's all it takes, just a hair of not being as quick can create an opportunity for your opponent to score. Hey, let's work up there. Eddie just needs to fire off. He just needs to fire off here. He's giving Trombley an opportunity to stay in it. He's got to fire off. Reaches with the left arm, trying to find the opposite leg. One thing that Trombley does not want to do, he does not want to force a shot. Trombley trying to communicate with his corner. You can see him with some words for Papalizio and the assistants. Yeah, they were saying, it looks like uh, they were saying that, hey, he might have pulled a headgear and they didn't want to throw the brick. So they said, no, don't, don't throw a brick there. Because his headgear slid over to the left side of his ear. Still made 48 seconds. Ventresca has got to keep the pressure. He's got to stall, Paul. He's got to force the action just a little bit. Vital match here. Vital match. Trying to the position here by Trombley as he works. And Tresca back a few steps. Doesn't appear to want to go anywhere with it. We'll go back into the center. And Trombley just looked a little slower. There's the shot. There's the shot. There's the shot. But look at this. Look at this. He might put him on his back. Do we have control yet? That's control. No. It's a neutral danger. There's the takedown. Off the offense. Neutral danger. That was explosive. And Tresca had it in. Looked like it was dead to his right. And then what happened? A little roll action there. Tresca gets in and looks like he's very looking at the company, but look, look what Trump do. He rolls over and then it's a neutral danger. Neutral danger, his back is in over a 90 degree. The official counts and Trumbly gets on the board for NC State. I tell you what, that shot 